Hello there, my name is Telono Barami Samuel. Now, there's a very important, um, exciting subject that I want to talk to you very briefly about and how to encourage someone through the third person. You see, we've talked in one of our uh, messages that it's important for us to focus on uplifting people and if we have to also correct people, we should do it positively with discipline, okay? Now, you could also uh, not only affirm directly, but you could also do that indirectly. Remember, you want to reinforce the positive uh, thing, catch people being positive and encourage them. Okay, so you could do this indirectly with a third person encouragement. If the person did something well, you might tell someone else, letting the person that did this to hear how proud you are about the person. That means praising people publicly but chastising them secretly. So if you told the person directly, sometimes they might just push it away. Some people are like that. But because you want that to sink, you want to reprogram his subconscious his mind. So you have to say, you, you, you could also say to the third person, but in a way that the person that carried out the action will hear. But if you tell it sometimes to the person, uh, even if the person is the person that will push it away, you know, in name of humility, but if he overhears it, he will take it. Good leaders, great moms and dads, great coaches are always seeing the good in another and affirming for them. They are, when you do that, you are helping the person to grow. So why don't you put up this challenge? This, um, it could be a 24-hour challenge and the challenge is no negative talk. You will always have self-talk that positive ones you only you, you 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 have the choice to either be negative or positive but this challenge would be in 24 hours i would not say anything negative not to myself not to anybody if you make a mistake and you say anything negative to yourself or anybody you are not out of the game you would repeat your 24 hour challenge and see how that works you can put that up in the office put that game up in the office in the family no negative affirmations on myself or anyone else for 24 hours no what's the matter with me or how could i be so stupid that's dumb you're not saying all of that no belittling no sarcasm toward others instead you'll have to replace that with something good about yourself or the other catch everyone catch yourself catch other people in the act of doing something well and affirming do this for 24 hours if you make a mistake you don't get to quit you just start another 24 hours you are going to become so aware of all the devaluation and belittling that goes on in the world in the paper over the radio on the television socially this is a way of bringing to your consciousness your conscious attention the negative behavior that is going on in the world around you that diminishes your self-worth and the self-worth of others so i encourage you this moment um take action right now in your team in your family your place of work 24 hours no negative talks no negative self um, affirmations just all positive and let's see how beautiful life can get thank you so much for listening and guess what go on succeeding bye for now